When you go on a motorcycle trip, there's a lot of manuals you want to bring, that being for your motorcycle or for cameras or other equipment. Bringing PDF files of the manuals is a lot easier than having a stack of paper booklets. This task is a lot easier to do on a desktop or a laptop computer. Always make sure that you go to the manufacturer's website when you download a manual. After downloading the file or files, you probably have to change the names of the files just so it makes more sense. Just make the name short and clear. If you have a full PDF editor, such as Adobe Acrobat Pro or DC, then you can rip out all the pages that you do not need from the document. That makes the document smaller and way, way easier to navigate through. An extreme example is this NOCO battery jump starter manual. They have 274 pages when you download it from the web, so they have every language under the sun. So when you rip out all you don't need, you're left with four pages. So after the manual have been downloaded, probably changed the name and then cleaned up, then you can upload it to the cloud. The cloud is just a bunch of servers, in other words, computers with big hard drives that are stuck in a warehouse somewhere and connected to the internet. In order to upload the PDF files to the cloud, and you can either do that by having an app installed on co your computer, such as for iCloud Drive, Google Drive, or Dropbox, or a similar cloud service. Or you can log on to the cloud drive through the web browser and just drag and drop the files into the folder. Making a subfolder on your cloud drive makes it a lot easier to organize and find your files when needed. And just drop all the files into this new subfolder. Depending on what phone system you use, if you use a Google phone or an Android phone, you're probably connected to Google Drive and then you can upload the documents there. If you use an iPhone, then you're probably connected to iCloud and upload the documents there. The drive folder on your phone, on an iPhone, that is the little icon that says files. It, when you click on it and open it, it automatically shows all the PDF documents, but it does not automatically download all the documents. This is from an iPhone, and all the documents with a little cloud in the upper right hand corners, they have not been downloaded. So all the ones with the cloud, you just need to click on it while you probably connect to the Wi-Fi or while, you, while you're in an area where you have internet, make sure that they're on your phone. When you click on the files with the little cloud, then they automatically download, not before. And then you can read about the torque numbers on your bike or about the features on your camera while the rain is pelting down outside your tent. So now I only need to try to convert my, all my tools into PDF documents so I can save on both weight and space. Thanks for watching. Have a good safe ride. Please subscribe. More videos to follow.